Even if you've been painting wet into wet for years, you will learn valuable tips from author, teacher, and artist Anne Pember. Anne works with watercolor's natural tendencies to create bold colors with a delicate touch. In this workshop, you'll learn what Anne looks for in a subject and how she captures its unique energy. Anne builds bold colors on the paper while she encourages the delicate shifts of hue and value inherent in her floral subjects. Anne has developed a system to ensure a clean result, including two water supplies and multiple brushes. Anne helps you make your own watercolors fresh, bold, and exciting in Vibrant Orchid, painting in the flow of watercolor. Hi, I'm Anne Pember, and I'd like to share with you today some of my thoughts and techniques of painting in watercolor. And my subject will be flowers. For me, the most exciting time is watching the flowers go from the bud stage into the full open stage and all of the things that happen in that transition, particularly interested in the effects of light. Actually, the subject of any painting is light. I like to look for the patterns that are formed by the light. I like to notice where the light struck areas tend to blend together. This happens also in the shade and it gives me an opportunity to connect and blend those edges. My work is still realism but I've gone from what I formerly painted which was a mere reporting of the object in front of me to thinking more in terms of leaving out some of the detail, letting the viewer's eye fill that in and suggesting what is there. I like to do that by softening edges. So as I paint, you're going to see me take a damp brush and soften edges quite often. I like the feeling of transition that happens, going from a hard edge to a soft edge. And I often use backlighting because I find it creates an excitement to the painting. It gives it an, a mood that I find appealing. Painting to me is a uh, a spiritual process and it has a lot to do with mood and feeling. I'm not just an observer, I'm hopefully painting a subject that I have a connection to. So I'm looking for the light and the pattern it forms, the quality of color, having it be luminous and fresh looking, and I'm looking for a beautiful edge quality. I started out painting with round brushes.